time now, those who got raffle tickets. Um, so the first that Ben is going to pull out is for a bike for Bart Jersey, which Ben is sporting here. Uh, but just echo Ben's words, um, lovely turnout here, amazing to be in Portsmouth promoting this centre. Um, and I uh, hope everyone had a great day. I mean, I did. I'm about to fall over, but I had an absolutely great day. So um, let's have a few more pints of Bart's beer. Um, so was three, there were three courses today. I think a 30 miler, a 70 and a 100. I definitely went for the middle one, not the long one. But um, yeah, it's, a really, it's a really fun to get a load of sailors doing another sport. I think that's because we're all hopeless at it. And... But everyone doesn't take it so seriously, you know, as, as, as someone where sailing's your sport every week, you're really competitive. Here, we're just having fun. Yep. And everyone's out there having a great laugh. Awesome, everyone. Did and anyone take any tumbles today? Uh, no. Yes. I, I took a little fall. Oh, sorry, speak up, speak up, Richard. I, I, I took a little fall, but it wasn't anything to do with the wind. It was just poor cycling, to be honest. Uh, <laughs> but I got straight back up. So oh, It was great, loved it. And <laughs> like Flappy said, good to catch up with so many friends. Yeah, yeah. And uh, as Ian said, with great cause. And, you know, Richard and the team are doing an amazing job, really so Richard, amazing job, so we're all very proud of it. So Richard, perhaps you can tell us a bit about what's been going on in the last year and what the plans are for this year. Yeah, I mean, like uh, Ian said, I mean, ultimately the aim of the foundation is to transform the lives of young people through sailing. Um, and each year we've been growing. So uh, in 2017, we had uh, 7,500 people on the water. This year, uh, just over 18,000. So it's been a massive growth year for us. Um, we've gone from uh, one center at the National Academy in Portland to three centers and our first overseas center, uh, sorry, four centers and our first overseas center as well. Um, so really we're just ramping up everything we're doing. I mean, and ultimately we're just using the, the, the power of sailing to transform the lives of young people, regardless of their circumstances. So it's amazing to see some of the, the young people and how sailing's impacting on their lives by, our, by the programs they're attending. And I noticed you've got a climbing wall here, so is there a sort of a broadening of activities going on, or is that... So yeah, it's full on. Yeah, it's quite full on climbing oh, on, actually. Yeah, that leap of faith. You should have a go. That's, that's quite sketchy. Because it actually yeah. straight up there, so it, start, it starts wobbling as soon as you get to the top as well. But yeah, I mean, ultimately, uh, the, the centre here in Portsmouth is an outdoor centre. So yeah, of course, we have the sailing. Uh, we have other water sports activities going on on the, on the, uh, on the water as well. And some land-based activities. The climbing wall, we also do archery. Um, the plan for this centre is that we're going to get residential accommodation over the next two years. So we'll be able to take 120 young people um, staying here uh, for their first sort of experience away from home, uh, which will be a real amazing sort of transformation for this site. Um, yeah, it's a pretty, pretty cool. Plan.